Okay guys, hi! It's Vic Vasquez, welcome back to my channel! <laughs> I've been trying to record this video for like two days now. I started recording it two days ago. Hello, how are we doing today? Yay! But then Callie woke up from his nap like 10 minutes after I put him down, so I couldn't record it. It's impossible to film a video when he's awake because he likes the camera. If he sees the camera, if he sees that I'm recording a video, he wants to be involved. He wants to be like, hey guys, hey guys, hey guys. Right now he's taking a nap. So hopefully I can finish this video so I can post it so I can be consistent for you guys. This video is going to be about party etiquette. It's crazy, I feel like people just don't know how to act. Honestly, people are just selfish or maybe they forget I'm not saying I'm perfect. I think it's important for people to just know some like common sense boundaries at parties, what to do and what not to do. So um, yeah, let's get started. The first thing I'm gonna start with is going to be about a little party that my mom hosted and that happened to be my baby shower. So I, Obviously, don't want to make it seem like me, 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 pay attention to me, love me, but like it's my baby shower, okay? It was a baby shower. It wasn't just like, oh, I had a party. I had a get together. It was my baby shower. Well, it was an all girls thing because I know that guys just don't enjoy baby showers. So I made it an all girls thing. I made it at like brunch time. Like my mom um, hired a photographer because my mom has a photographer every event that she hosts so she had a photographer there taking photos of the um, baby shower people were getting there I was having a great time vibes were good and then one person got there by the way I obviously invited people that like I wanted to be there and was friends with I don't invite people like that I'm not friends with it's interesting how like quick you can like think you're friends with people and invite them to like special moments in your life and they can just literally make you question why you're even friends with them but anyways one person got there and I think we maybe had said like three or four words to each other before I was like oh I saw you guys went out last night like are you feeling okay today like I saw like a group of girls that I had invited they went out the night before to like the club so I was like oh are you guys feeling okay because I know it's like early this is like a brunch baby shower it was like 11.30. I was just creating conversation. She goes, I'm going to create a name for the person she's talking about. So that's going to be Amanda. So she says, yeah, but last night Amanda was like, oh, tomorrow we have Victoria's baby shower. Oh, I don't want to go. Obviously, I laughed it off and I was like, <laughs> who knows actually what I, I probably was like, uh -huh. knowing me, I was like, but I don't know. I think I just laughed it off because like I didn't say like, oh, that's kind of fucking rude. <laughs> and that's kind of weird that you're telling me that it's not something a normal something that somebody would tell the person having the baby shower that somebody the night before was like complaining about going to the baby shower i just don't like people don't like think it's weird it's super weird anyways that the person that she was talking about amanda gets to the party you can tell she's like not happy to be there she like barely says anything to me shocker so let me take one second to say when you get to a party that somebody invited you to make sure you say hi to the person that invited you the person whose home it is if it's somebody else's home say hi to the person that invited you say say hi to the person whose home it is oh wow thank you for having us in your home what a lovely home hey i'm so happy to see you i'm so happy to be here for your baby shower this is beautiful i love what you've done with everything like have manners you greet people I know you have best friends at the party that you're better friends with, but like if the first thing you do when you get into a party is run up to your best friend, then like you should really think about 
having some manners and greeting the people who invited you or the host of the party or something like like let's be grown you know they're obviously doing their thing majority of the time we all take pictures like together and stuff like here and there um whatever and then a group of a group of girls i would say like six seven or eight maybe we're like in my mom's backyard which is like really big because she lives on like a golf course so like we're in one area like taking pictures or like i'm taking pictures with um everybody like i'm thinking like okay this is the time that i'm gonna take pictures with everybody so i'm kind of like switching out my like really good friends are like taking turns like taking pictures with me and then like me and my good friends like all like turn our heads to the side and in the complete like opposite corner of like the backyard like closer to like where the golf course is we see like a group of like six or seven or eight girls with they <laughs> they've accosted the photographer to come over to that area um no just kidding i don't know if that happened honestly the photographer probably went over there anyways they're like having a full-on like photo shoot like where's the application for kappa delta sigma whatever the fuck because this is like some sorority ass photos they're taking they're like they're like setting up and like sitting in the chairs and like everything is in line and then they're like running down the hills holding hands like it's like a whole on photo shoot. Like it, cre it creates a whole thing because like all my friends were like looking at them. And then one of my friends was like, what the fuck? Like, what the fuck are they doing? Like, why are you not over there? Like, what the fuck? To be honest, like I was just like, that's funny. Like that's, that's funny. I, I, hon I honestly didn't care that much. One of my friends starts like going over there saying, you guys, you guys. And I'm like, no, 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 no. Oh, it's okay. Please don't say anything. Please don't say anything. Please don't. You guys, come over here. Take pictures with Victoria. And I see one of them turn to her and be like, we already did. We already did take pictures with Victoria. And my friend's like, take more. <laughs> I'm like, okay, this is awkward. Is this a huge deal? No. Like, did I hate these girls afterwards? No. I'm gonna show you guys one of the photos that, that was taken because it's just like literally like, it looks like <laughs> cookie cutter photo. Like, I mean, look at that. Look how nice that looks. Like, I'm sorry, but like, why wasn't I in that photo? Like, if y'all are like, I don't know. I feel like if I was down there, I'm so in tune with like other people, in my opinion. If you don't agree with me, like, let me know. Text me. Be like, girl, sorry, but you're actually not. I feel like I'm so considerate of people's feelings. Like if I was down there in that moment and I noticed that the like fucking photographer for the event was there and I was like having such a great time with my friends and like it was like all of us girls, I'd be like, where the fuck is Victoria at? Get Victoria down here right now. Like she needs to be in these pictures. Not one of them had that thought. I feel like I would totally have that thought if it was like my friend having the baby shower. Like not, I, and I just, I like, that's the part that I don't understand. Most of those girls were posting like that photo that I just showed you and like pictures of them like running down the hill and stuff. And there would be no caption like, Congratulations, Victoria. We can't wait to welcome this bundle of joy or whatever the fuck. You know, whatever you say when you go to somebody's baby shower and you take a picture of the baby shower, usually you post a picture with the person. Like, no, no. Like, these girls hate me in their photos. Like, I have realized these girls literally hate me in their photos. Like, I am the girl that gets asked to take the photos. And this has been like all my life. I think people just don't get good vibes from me, which I hate because I'm so, I'm so like good vibes in my head. I don't know. I don't know like what energy I put out into the world, but it is definitely an energy that gives people the idea that I don't want them to talk to me or be my friend or fuck with me at all. That was just an example of some bad party etiquette in my opinion. Sorry, my camera died. So I'm recording on my phone, um, but I'm almost done here. 
I want this to be made very crystal clear. The point of my videos is not to talk shit about people. It's not to expose people. It's not to spill tea about other people's private matters. First of all, I'm only talking about stuff that has to deal with me. The point is, is we all fuck up. Don't like single people out or like cut somebody off just because they aren't perfect because you're not perfect either. I think what this video is really about is consideration, being a considerate person. I just like run into so many instances where I noticed that people that I really care about couldn't give less of a fuck about my feeling. It's okay to fuck up. We're human, we're gonna do it. It's okay that a bunch of girls came to my baby shower and got excited about taking cute pictures but like what's important is like the way you respond or react to somebody getting their feelings hurt if you're their friend you know you don't talk shit about them and call them dramatic and sensitive and bitchy with like <laughs> with like your closer group of friends you take time to like say hey like if i hurt your feelings i'm really sorry uh, I don't think that's too much to ask for. And I think that is like the real sign of like maturity and growth. Even if you don't think your behavior was unnecessary, but you still made somebody feel like that. If you care about that person, you're, you should, <laughs> you should have a conversation with them and be like, Hey, look, I noticed I hurt your feelings. Like, Anyways, subscribe, like, comment, share, be a good person, and make mistakes. Just fix them. React the right way. And don't be an asshole. Okay, bye. See you later. Have a nice day.